Good morning everybody. Can you believe it's 19 degrees today? Honestly, after all the rain we've had, all the wind, and now it's like a summer's day. It's just absolutely crazy. So, plan of action today is I have called Evie Rose and asked her if she would like to join me on a walk and we are going to find a waterfall and I will say find very loosely there's a good chance I will not be finding a waterfall as you know I do have trouble finding things but that's the plan anyway I've had a couple of good bits of news this morning already as well that's why I'm in a very happy mood today I'm always happy but I'm even happier today so overnight my YouTube account has now been fully monetized which means I will get a little bit of revenue from the ads I know it isn't going to be a lot but it's just the fact I set out to do this and I've succeeded in doing it so I'm really really pleased I'm sorry if that sun is blinding you all there beaming through my window um, yeah so I'm really really pleased about that I didn't think I would do it so quickly and it's all down to you lot you've all made it happen for me so thank you so much honestly it's like I am just I'm overwhelmed I really am so that was the first bit of good news and then I have also as you know been trying to um, come up with a remedy let me just see if this makes a difference I did just stop and move the camera because the sun was sort of created a bit of a blur on my face probably not a bad thing really but <laughs> some of you might like to see my smiley face today um so what was I saying oh yes as you know regarding the awning um I've been trying to sort of rectify this bad pitching issue not it's not the awning that's the problem the actual make of the awning which I have pointed out a few times it's actually my pitch that's the problem However, I have had a call and the retailer are providing me with a new full set of poles and they are the upgraded poles which they've said will be more suitable for my pitch um, because they've looked at all the videos I've sent them, all the photographs and they said the way I'm pitching the awning is correct however because of the nature of the land underneath the awning that's the problem so yeah they've sent me, they are sending me up a full set of upgraded poles so it'll then be next season when I use the new poles it's not worth swapping them over now for a few weeks but at least I've got that bit of reassurance that when the awning does go up the poles will be sufficient so yes I am really pleased about that I've actually had no problems with the awning since I got here and obviously we've had a lot of rain a lot of wind and it, it's been absolutely fine so yeah with the new poles as well I shouldn't have any worries whatsoever anyway I hope you are all having a bit of sunshine and I will catch you all later when I'm on my walk with Evie bye for now have Evie Rose with me as you can see and found out whilst I'm driving to this waterfall walk it's actually about 10 minutes from the place I was talking about in an early video about the cabin I went to see so we've taken a little detour and I thought I'd show you where these cabins are so this is the location Are the cabins how 
lovely is this? Oh yeah. Giving nice. centre parks vibes. It is giving centre parks vibes, isn't it? But you see it's not fenced in. Yeah. It's like just all open countryside. Yeah, and then there's a dog walking area which has got like a river in it. How lovely is this? We've actually got out and I'm going to walk up and show her where the cabin is. So this is just like at the edge of all the cabins. And then you, you just walk onto it here. And like I say, location, absolutely stunning, isn't yeah. it, Eve? Very nice. Could you see me living here? Yeah. Look how quiet it is. Yeah. Head north. Oh, <laughs> head north, Evie. <laughs> that's we sat nav, guys. <laughs> this is the actual one that's for sale. Very overgrown. Needs a lot of work. But it's a freehold one, whereas all the others are leasehold. So, if you want some info, drop us a message in the comments. I'm like an estate agent now, aren't I, as well? <laughs> I'm not on commission, by the way. Sent her out to do her duties. She's like, Mum, are you sure this isn't someone's garden? <laughs> I was like, well, I don't think so, but we're going to find out when we go through. <laughs> Look at her face. She's not impressed. I thought, like, the, the rope could, like, be pulled from the other side, if that makes sense, though he just wasn't. Are we guessing there's parking down here or not? Yeah. Let's be optimistic. Well, you know, That's why I said it's a road, it's gotta lead to all this hell. Oh, it's a road. It's dirty sheep. Oh, it's had a road once from me, I think. somewhere to park if it's directing us this way. Oh, but you were not in anything too wide. Oh, that was a house. There's more sheep. More sheep. Much more oh, more sheep. <laughs> well, it's, it's a nice little drive. Nice oh, there's sheep. some people. Oh, this might be where to park maybe. Sorry, I'm whizzing past you there. Right. <laughs> yeah. Well, we nearly got um, roped into some canyoning. Is a Can sport that combines several outdoor sports like rock climbing, hiking, swimming, and oh. they cut something off. Canyoning. Yes. We we um we nearly parked up to join a canyoning oh, group. <laughs> I couldn't quite understand what you were well asking fun. us. Well, we're not joining it. <laughs> I, oh, oh, another gate, Eve. Oh, she wants to go canyoning now. Maybe another day. <laughs> right. I think we're here anyway. We've made it. I did get completely confused what he was asking me. He asked me the same thing about five times. I was like, what's he asking me? Canyoning. I've never, ever heard of canyoning in my life. Right, we're at the car park, so we've made it in one piece, unscathed. And now we're going to get out and go and find this waterfall. So it's not started very well. We actually got out of the car. Molly, that side. And went the wrong way, don't we? <laughs> I'd like to make it known that's a really heavy gate. I've opened it for three people now and them ones didn't seem very great. And not one of them tipped you, did they? Well, them ones didn't even look appreciative. Oh. That's just so, yes, we, we got out of the car. Um, we went right instead of left, didn't we? 
Couldn't even get the old trails to work properly because that's what we're using today. So we shouldn't get lost. I'm not wearing my jacket now. I'm going to take my jacket off. It's warm, isn't it? I thought we were walking through a forest and that it's was It's lovely. But I was just thinking, I bet oh, when we pulled you. up and that guy was asking about the canyon. Canyoning. Can you, not canyoning. Canyoning, that's what they do in hospitals. Yeah, that's a cannula. Right, well, not canyoning. when he was asking about did we want to partake in that extreme sport, he probably, I bet he had fear when he seen me and mm. he probably thought, oh, God, I've got a geriatric one here. Imagine... Look at that sheep, look at its tail. Ca oh. There's, they're all oh. like that. Those are black sheep with white tails. That's a bit quirky. And that's little that. white stripes on their heads. <gasps> Cheer them in a minute. But yeah, he probably had immense relief when I drove mm. off. I'm gonna walk back now and say, actually, yeah, can we join in? <laughs> I've got my swimsuit on. <laughs> Let's look at these sheep. So yeah, there's black sheep with white tips on the tails, white feet and white on the faces. How cute are those? Okay, zoom in ahead. You know, it did say on a lot of the things that part of it's closed, so you kind of have to go around a bit of a different way. Right. Oh, this is going to be interesting. This is leaving us wide open to get lost, oh, isn't it? Be. Oh, God, there's too many dogs okay. now. Okay. I've got one eating poo, one keeps getting wrapped up around me. <laughs> Come on. Oh, one oh, no, it's the actual bridge there that's closed, yeah. so we are going to have to find an alternative way around, I think. Well, the bridge is a bridge, Mother. I don't think, like, we need to cross her. If, there, if it's closed, then we kind of can't cross. Right, well, let's go further up the road and see if we can walk around that way anyway. Okay. Oh, how long have we been out the car? Five minutes. <laughs> we found a path, haven't we? Yeah. We've we used a bit of our own initiative, and then we followed some people, and then we've asked somebody, and we can get to it this way. It's just a bit wet. <laughs> Eva did say, should we just turn around and is there anywhere else you want to go? To which I replied, no. No, I want to see the waterfall. I want to see the waterfall and we will see it. Oh, it's very warm though, isn't yeah. it? It's lovely. Anyway, onwards and upwards, eh? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a if there's a gate, that's a good sign. Hey, this is looking very promising. Oh, there we go. There you go, Mal. What did you think at that other point they would direct you up this way, though? Yeah. There is no sign is the saying no. to walk left it basically says you can't cross the bridge but this is where we are anyway god we are on a strenuous <laughs> i knew <laughs> you'd notice that then <laughs> no it'll be fine highlights feel the spray from the waterfall marvel at the deep ravine gently press cushion moss and feel its dampness is one of the highlights. Oh, can't wait for that. We get to feel some moss, Mother, on you. It's like magical for mosses and liverworts. Mm. This, is, this is one of uh, Wales' rainforests. See, this is going to be spectacular. You're going to regret not wearing your swimming costume now. I, I, I'm okay. You'll be so jealous of me feeling that hungry. It's one of right, you know? well, we'll stop and get um, a bite to eat in a bit, okay? If it says it's going to take us an hour to get to this waterfall, it's going to be two o'clock. Right, well, we'll stop en route. And I had my breakfast at nine this morning, so. <laughs> okay. When we get to a nice clearing, we'll stop it's and a have long lunch. Time I'm hungry. I'm a growing, I'm a growing girl, mother. You are indeed. At the age of 19, I'm a growing girl. <laughs> Right. So that's the path we would have been on if the bridge hadn't have been closed. And this is where we are. And we have caught a little glimpse of it and it does look pretty amazing, doesn't it, Evie? Yeah. Yeah. Molly's very eager to get down. So this is where we're going to have our dinner. Mm. Woo! <laughs> 
Look at this. Oh, look at Evie. Oh, that is lovely. Look at this. Absolutely stunning. Oh, we've got a very wet dog. She's already sampled it. Better spot for lunch. Oh, let's dry off. Let my legs dry off a bit. Come on, what have you got for lunch? Uh, a spinach omelette. Yeah. Uh, oats oh, we balm or bap or bread well, cake? I'd say roll. Roll. It's a roll, bread roll. <laughs> so you got spinach, balm, roll. Omelette thing, yeah. Yeah, what's he? Oh, nice. Uh, turkey? Yeah. Uh, cinnamon oat pancakes. Yeah, do you make them? Yeah. Wow, okay. And grapes. Very good. Well, do you know what I've got? What? A fake chicken sandwich. Mine's more <laughs> impressive than yours. <laughs> ah. Right, lunchtime, and then I might even have a little dip in there. Well, I said to Evie, oh, I'm going to get changed. She was just about to just strip off, and then she went, Oh look, there's some people doing that thing. So we're gonna actually abseil down there. That does look fun actually. Well, they nearly got to see me back. <laughs> So we, we've just watched them. It's actually really good. So they sail down the rock and they get so far down and then just drop into the water and it's quite deep. So I've just asked about it and it's £70. So I'm trying to convince TV to do it because I want to do it now. They said you um, come all the way down the river, you slip and slide all the way down and then you get to this point here. It does look good fun.
We were just saying then how humid the air is. We can see why they say it's like a tropical rainforest. It's not that I've ever been in a tropical rainforest. But with the heat and all the trees and the water, it's just like a... It's, how would you describe it? The air's like... Is it like clammy? Is it a bit clammy? Yeah. So we're heading now. We I feel like this is something oh. Bali would describe as muggy. Muggy, muggy, that's it. <laughs> we think this might be taking us to sort of like where the top of the waterfall might be. Although we've, you know, we've probably come a bit far, haven't we, for the top of the waterfall? Yeah. It's part of the path. It's like, in. A wave, not a wave, but... like a pond. Oh, this is not passing, my Molly can definitely oh, oh, <laughs> hear the water. Oh, oh. oh here, it's a little sign here telling us where we are. Oh, it's nice. She's gone down to the water. There she is. Oh. No. Not in there. Gosh, that looks quite deep, doesn't yeah. it? We just read the sign and we're in a gorge. Are you coming down, Evie? Are you coming down? Pardon? Oh, okay. Oh, jeez, a big steps. <laughs> Go on, Ma. His little legs come in. How? Oh, okay. How on them? Go down. Right. Don't go in there. Molly. Oh, it's quite mystical. It's lovely. How calm the water is there. It's just so flat. Till bugger lugs goes in. What a lovely place. last nope i'm concerned we took a, an alternate route yeah and we still found our own way didn't we maybe our sense of direction is getting a little bit better maybe <sighs> come on Mel. did you enjoy that walk yeah that was definitely a good one to do it is very hot we are now going to should we stop off somewhere on yeah, the way sure. back post maddock maybe yeah yeah Go and get, let's go and find somewhere that does dairy-free ice cream. Ooh. Is it Cadwallader's? I don't know. I think it's called that. I think it's Cadwallader's. Oh, <laughs> Cadwallader's in Portmadoc. We'll go and try there because I feel like an ice cream. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And it's over and out from us, isn't it, Evie Rose? Okay. We'll see you on the next adventure. Mm. Woo!